Hey, let's quickly see how to set up Windows EC2 instance on Amazon Web Services and connecting to it. Let's go to EC2, click on Launch Instance. Let's pick uh, Microsoft Windows Server, which is free to eligible. We're okay with uh, T2 Micro. Go to Next Step. And uh, let's leave the options as it is. Move on to add storage. We are good with a 30 GB hard disk. Tax. Let's give a name. A security group. Uh, select existing or create new. Make sure. Uh, uh, all traffic is allowed, but in uh, production environments, we should customize security groups and we should keep it very secure. We should not give open uh, access to our uh, EC2 instances. But for this demonstration, I'm keeping it all traffic. Review, launch. Okay. Uh, let's choose a key pair. Acknowledge launch instance so this takes a while and uh, until that i will pause my video and i'll get back all right so meanwhile for connecting to windows uh, ec2 instance we need rtp i am doing this on my macbook uh, i need to install rtp client on macbook which is a Microsoft Remote Desktop. If you are doing this on uh, Windows itself, uh, you don't have to install a special software. Uh, RDP is built into Windows. Now select this, uh, click on Connect, or uh, choose RDP Client. Of course, the username is administrator that's default username of uh, windows in aws and next we will see uh, how to get password so here let's add a pc let's give the name i mean the host name or ip address i'm picking up the host name okay and you could say add i will remove the other one so let's double click this it will prompt us for username and password double click username let's uh, grab username username is administrator and uh, let's grab password so click on get password it will ask you for the pem file browse that this is the one browse and uh, decrypt copy the password paste it here say connect and uh, yeah say continue that's it that's how we launch windows ec2 instance and connect to it using uh, microsoft remote desktop protocol thanks for watching this video and i will see you again with next video